Okay, we're back. Welcome back. This is part 46, no, 47. And uh, we just beat Byron. We didn't lose any Pokemon, so that's sweet. Um, I changed up my team again. So, yeah, we have Nimbus back. We have uh, Truffles back. Yeah, that's it. I didn't, I took Sharkeesha off the team because, um, because, like, Ice-type gym, Garchomp don't mix very well, so... Uh, we're just gonna stick with what we have. I mean, Nimbus is also weak to ice, but we can solve that problem when we get there, and, like, I like having a flyer on my team. So now we're going to the library. I think we have a bunch of things to do before we get to Snowpoint City, so we might have to deal with Team um, Galactic first, but I'm not sure. Okay, so first we have to go to the Three Lakes. Um, I think we're supposed to go to Lake Verity. Okay, no, she goes to Lake Verity. We're going to Lake Acuity. You know what? I, I was I was completely wrong about both of those, so I guess the last one's Lake Valor. That's where we're going. This is when they set the bomb off at Lake Valor, I think. Yeah. It must have been a big bomb if, like, it caused earthquakes all over the region. I'm surprised it didn't it didn't destroy more than just the lake. Like, that was a large explosion. That's like nuclear. How far away was that? We're like on the other side of the region too. I feel like that should have destroyed the Valor Lakefront as well. But oh well, I guess it just blew all the water out of the lake. Really? There's a huge explosion at Lake Valor, but he's like, oh, but everything's fine, don't worry about it. There was a huge explosion at Lake Valor. I feel like that should be a, a bigger priority, and he's just like, no, don't worry about it, it was just an explosion, and he just leaves. Okay, oh well, we're going to Lake Valor. I should probably have uh, leveled out my Pokemon a little bit more, because now I think I'm under-leveled, but uh, let's just use our rare candies, just because just we can. Level up Nimbus once, and then we'll level up Truffles twice. There, now our Pokemon are on, uh, on par. I think we can also get an encounter at Lake Valor. Well, maybe not because the water's gone, but I think that. Like, we haven't gotten anything at Lake Valor, so... I hope there's still some water here for me to fish or something. Maybe I can catch one of these Magikarp? No. I was- I was always really sad about these Magikarp just dying as the- <laughs> as the lake exploded. There have to have been more Pokemon in this lake than Magikarp, right? What about them? Oh, okay. Oh, I really expected Nimbus to die there, but that didn't do very much damage. Well, I'm gonna switch anyways. Um, play rough. Let's switch out this floor. Now we can surf it. to get more moon milks pretty soon. Once I drop under 20, it's like we're at a critical level of moon milks. I wonder what all those small craters are. Did they set up a ton of small bombs? I feel like there's no like large crater, it's just did they set up one bomb, right? It shouldn't be all this destruction. Well, there should be all this destruction, but like, I don't- I feel like it shouldn't be spread out like this. I'm weak to poison, so I don't want to get hit by like a sludge bomb. Um... Yeah. We're just gonna heal again.
Houndoom. I don't think Houndoom has anything that would beat me, so we'll just use... I mean, Dragon Pulse? No, but Moonblast is stronger. I think we have to fight Saturn here. Maybe it's just Mars again. I think it might be Mars. I think the lake gets refilled with water back at some point. I don't know how, but... Um, at some point we'll be able to come back here and get an encounter. Okay, it is Saturn. I don't remember what Saturn's, like, ace Pokemon is. But I guess we'll find out. Have we fought Saturn? I think we have. I don't remember fighting him. Alakazam's a huge problem, though. Last time I fought an Alakazam, it had Shadow Ball, Dazzling Gleam, Psychic, and uh, Energy Ball. This, it could have Focus Blast, but I feel like Bessie takes a Focus Blast better than Schnoz does. And it's setting up on me. We're just gonna Strength and hope it goes down. It didn't go down. And it does have Focus Blast, yeah, Bessie's dead from that. Oh my god, it's not? Wow, that's a plus two focus blast from Alakazam. I don't need Brave Bird. Okay, well, I'm happy that I have Bessie then. Toxicroak. Um, Toxicroak is double to Psychic. I don't have any Psychic type moves. Oh, yes, I do. Well, Expo is definitely faster than this guy, so. Goodbye, Toxic Rope. Octillery. Jello has Giga Drain for this specific reason. I like how well rounded our team is recently. It's actually keeping us alive. Having, like, actually strong Pokemon like, to deal with threats like Expo and then tanky Pokemon like Schnoz and Bessie. It feels so much better than just having a team of all tanks. Or a team of all damage. Bronzong. Uh -huh. Let's just, uh... We can't stay in. Like, a lot of things I have are weak to Bronzong. I could have Earthquake, that's why I don't want to send an Expo. And if I do, it could have Heat Proof instead of Levitate just to prank me. So we'll go with Bessie, we'll just heal. Unfortunately, Bessie has so much health that I have to use my um, Hyper Potions on it. Otherwise, it won't do anything. Even then, a Hyper Potion doesn't heal it fully. I need Max Potions. Okay, I don't think this one's heat proof. Okay, so Mars is at Lake Verity. That's where we're going next. So yeah, I don't think there's any water here that we can just like fish in, so we'll just have to come back later. Okay, yeah, let's get out of here. We're actually gonna... This is Lake Verity, right? I think I've already gotten an encounter at Lake Verity, so I can't get anything there. Okay, well we got a bunch of double battles coming up, so that, that makes me kind of worried. Hopefully nothing bad happens. Dust Ox and Beauty Fly. We're gonna take out the Beauty Fly first. It's definitely the bigger threat. Flamethrower the Dust Ox, and then we'll flamethrower the Beauty Fly. Okay, that's fine. Dust Ox choosing not to do anything is honestly the best course of action. Whoops, I forgot to mute that. I'm gonna have to <laughs> go through myself now. Um, we're gonna kill the Butterfree, because I feel like that's a bigger threat. We could have like Sleep Powder or something. 
been coughing a lot recently, it's just that I've remembered to mute them, but that one came so suddenly. Alright, this guy just like, sparing protect, he hasn't done anything else. I need to heal Expo, that life orb's taking a toll on him. Um, let's go with Schnoz and Bessie. So Mars is the one with her ugly. Her ugly's kinda scary. I think Schnoz can take care of her ugly without too many problems. Actually, no, that's not true. It gets wake up slap. I might have superpower too. Crap, that's not good. Oh well, well, we'll deal with that when we get to it. First, let's take out this guy. I don't get why these Toxic Rope and Golbat keep using Nasty Plot without you having any special attacks. I mean, that one might have had some special attacks, but like, I don't know, it just keeps happening. And another Golbat. Um, Fire Punch for the dam. See, even this Golbat has Nasty Plot. Fire Punch should do the trick. Mother was pretty fast. Okay. Um, I could go back and heal, which I think I will do just because Snorlax is going to take a while to die to poison, so we're not in any worries here. What did she normally have? I think in her first battle she led with Luxio, or maybe it was just a Zubat. I fought her twice so far. I fought her in Eternity City too. But I don't remember what she had. Let's lead with Bessie. If something easy to take care of comes out, I'll click Belly Drum. And then the fight's over. Crobat. Um. I don't think Crobat has any, like, Super damaging moves for me, so I'll just click Belly Drum anyways. Yeah, double team. Now we'll go for strength. Hopefully it doesn't miss. Yes. I wanted to heal, but I also didn't want him to get any more free turns of double team up. Yon Mega. Well, that's a special attacker, so I don't think he'll do too much to Snorlax. I mean, Snorlax took a plus two hit. A plus two focus blast from an Alakazam, so I'm not worried about anything from special attacking anymore. I should have gone for strength. Strength's gonna kill too, but and it has a chance to raise my. I mean, raising my attack doesn't matter. I'm already at max attack, so it doesn't matter what I go for. Kangaskhan's kind of scary. Oh no. Okay, never mind. Snorlax is super tanky, anyways. Good job, Snorlax. But now my defense is lowered, so I think we're gonna switch out if Perugly comes in. Yep. Um, let's see. It gets play rough. Play rough, maybe like return or something or strength. Maybe a fighting type move. It does fake out for sure, so. Eh, let's stay in. Let's stay in. Um, wait, I forgot my defense was lowered. <laughs> I wasn't really thinking this through. Well, he's gonna fake out me, so I'll just switch to Schnoz. He doesn't have fake out. He also doesn't have a fighting type move. Otherwise, he's going for it. Let's 
sweet. That went well pretty well. Um, Bronzong. I'll just use Expo. Could be heat proof, but what's it gonna do? Wait, it could explode. Okay, it's not heat proof. We're good. <laughs> I could, if it didn't die that flamethrower, I'm almost sure it would have exploded. Okay, so now we have to go to Spear Pillar. I think. Maybe we're supposed to go to the last lake. Yeah, we gotta go to Lake Acuity. Oh, we can surf on the water now. Let's do that. Let's see what's over here. Just because we can. I already have my encounter, so this surf encounter doesn't doesn't matter. But I think there's something on the other side of the lake I want. Nothing in here for me yet. I can come back and catch my sprit as well from Yuxi right after I beat Team Galactic at Spear Pillar. And they'd be really good to add to the team because my uh, I'm kind of running out of good Pokemon and they'd be a good uh, supplement. The team for Fire Blast. That's nice. I mean, honestly, that'd be perfect for Expo, but I'm too scared of it missing. I'd, it's flamethrower one shots everything. Like, no reason to risk Fire Blast, even though it is way stronger. I could teach Fire Blast to. Let's do that actually. Let's teach Fire Blast to Nimbus. I'd rather go for power on Nimbus. Team 33, I think. No, wait. 38. Cool. Okay, so we actually beat two of uh, Team Galactic's guys. So, yeah, I guess we'll uh, go head to Snowpoint City next time. So thanks for watching. We'll be back. Or maybe we're supposed to go to Spear Pillar. I don't know. It's one of those. We'll, we'll see what happens. So, yeah, thanks for watching.